Out in the fields under the sun Durian's harvest we've begun Country roads lead the way in every basket Hi, I'm Durian Tauke. Nice meeting you. Durian season is around the corner. Everybody is very excited. He's going to KL, he's going to Finland, going to Johor, going to Malacca, Salambang, to eat Durian. Or some even go to Kelantan. A lot of Singaporeans, those people in town, don't know how to pick a good Durian. Today, Durian Tauke is going to share with you, he's going to teach you how to use these five steps to, to pick the best durian suitable for you. Of course, different people, different case. In Google search, I found out some misleading information in Google search, right? Because different people, different views. Now, look at Google search, how to pick a good durian. There's a, about 5 million search in this topic. So if you were to search how to pick a good durian, Maybe you can look at the Asian's point of view is more suitable for you. Now, very simple. Different people have different case. Of course, in Google search, we see that foreigners' views, Amor views, are completely different from Asian's point of views. For example, stinky tofu. Many people feel that very, very stinky. It tastes like a sewer. But some people, they like it very much and they really love it and can't have enough of it. Today, I'm going to share with you. Today, Durian Tauke is going to teach you how to pick a good durian, best durian suitable for you. Let's go! fields under the sun, durian's harvest we've begun. Country roads lead the way in every basket. Durian sway, country harvest in the air. Durian's bounty beyond compare. In this country song, we sing our praise for Durian's blessings all our days. Bagus, best, ah. Huh? Amal datang lagi. Before teaching everyone how to choose durian, it is important that to note that. Choosing Thai durian and Malaysian durian is different because Malaysians eat durians that fall from the trees, while Thai people eat durians plucked from the trees. Here are some fine methods specialists for Malaysian durian. These methods will help you choose the best tasting durian. First one, observe appearances. Choose durian with beautiful outer skins. The color is not important, but avoid durians with cracks or damage on the outer skin. Cracks on the outer skin may indicate that durian is overripe or damaged, affecting taste and quality. Number two, smell it. Take a whiff of the durian's aroma. Good durians should have a strong fragrance, but should not have a pungent or moldy odor. If there is an overly pungent or moldy smell, the durians might be overripe or not fresh. Number three, check the durian stem. A fresh durian will have a stem that looks fresh. You can also scratch it with your fingernails. And if it leaves a mark, it proves that it is fresh. If the stem is dry, it indicates that the durian is not fresh. Pick up the durian, hold it to your ear and gently shake it. Listen for a clear or hollow sound inside. If there is such a sound, it indicates that the durian's flesh is still sweet and delicious. Number five, choose durians with at least five sections. Have you ever eaten a durian that with only three or two sections, even though the durian is large, but you might feel a bit cheated or scammed? because the flesh is only a few. If you choose durian based on these five methods, you are perfect. Having said that, of course, you guys still have to know some basic knowledge like durian varieties. There are numerous types of durians, each with own unique flavor, textures, and aroma. Some popular varieties including Musang King, Black Thorn, some people say Ochi or Duri Hitam, 
Anghe, Holo, Capri, D24, XO, and so on, so on. Uh, this is uh, the knowledge that you need to know. Secondly, you need to know how to deal with the durian seller. It is important to buy durian from reputable vendors who are knowledgeable about the different variety of durians can provide a guidance and selecting the best fruit for you. Thank you very much. If you don't subscribe my channel, please do it now. If you like it, please share it to your friends. I'm going to see you next time.